Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to Creative World. The formula written here is intensively used in electrical engineering. This is basically the formula of line voltage which are measured between two phases. Uh, it states that the line voltages are equal to the under root 3 times of V phase and their angle is 30 per uh, degree leading with uh, phase voltages. So today uh, I would like to share with you that how and why we take uh, line voltage as under root 3 times V phase and the angle of line voltage as 30 degree leading then phase voltage. So let's begin. Firstly I would uh, draw the vector form of three phase voltages. Here is my x axis, here is my y axis and the first red phase is uh, drawn on x axis with the reference 0 degree and its amplitude is Va. Second uh, yellow phase is drawn on 120 degree and its magnitude is Vb and third blue phase having magnitude Vc uh, all of these are separated by 120 degree angle with each other as we know in the case of three phase all the phases are separated from each other from 20, 120 degree now uh, we will solve this example using vector addition uh, we will be using a vector head to tail rule to solve this scenario I am basically calculating the line voltage between VA and VB firstly I have drawn the replica of VB on the head of VA because we know that in order to perform head to tail addition we need to start the second vector from the head of first vector so I just swapped it on same axis and placed it here with same angles I did not uh, disturb the angles uh, it was making angle from this axis 120 degree and here it is also making 120 degree angle the other angle is once uh, only 60 because we need to uh, fulfill the requirement of 180 degree now we need to find out this resultant vector which will become the addition of VA and VB we will also calculate the theta this theta will be the angle of resultant vector VAB here I have taken only the section which we are going to solve uh, VA is here VB is here and we need to find out VAB also the angle of VAB firstly we will resolve this vector in red color and yellow vector uh, we will solve uh, we will resolve these two vectors into their rectangular components then we will perform the addition and find out the components of VAB here firstly the rectangular components of VA is found uh, vector VA rectangular components are given here uh, we know that uh, in order to find out the horizontal component of vector we take the cosine of the angle of that vector and multiplying with its magnitude similarly uh, for the or, uh, vertical uh, component of that vector we take the sine of that uh, vector angle and multiply with its magnitude here we have find out the components of rectangular components of VA vector which are given here VA cos 0 degree plus J VA sin 0 degree in order to find out the rectangular components of vector VB we are taking this angle 60 degree 
so its horizontal component will be vb cos 60 degree and its vertical component will be vb sin 60 degree we have find out the rectangular components of va and vb we will add the rectangular components of both vectors to form the rectangular components of vab vector so horizontal uh, component of va and horizontal component of vb are added together and vertical components of va and vb are added together after putting these trigonometric values of these angles into the equation we find out the rectangular components of vab vector now for the magnitude we will use this formula we will square the uh, sum of horizontal component as well as vertical components and uh, take their square root so vab will be the square of horizontal component plus square of vertical component by solving this equation we found out vab equal to under root 3 va here i would like to mention a thing in three phase system we have same amplitude of all three phases they are separated with uh, 120 degree of angle but they have same voltage so uh, here for easiness of uh, scenario i have considered va equal to vb so i have replaced the vb with va the magnitude of vab is calculated for angle calculation we used the formula theta equal to tan inverse y over x uh, or you may say that the vertical component divided by horizontal component here our vertical component was this and horizontal component was this by simply solving this we got this va is cut by this 2 is cut by this and we got under root 3 over 3 or we may write it as 1 over under root 3 and we know that the tan inverse of under 1 over under root 3 is equal to 30 degree so we may write both these in this form and hence proved this formula that our line voltage is equal to under root 3 times the amplitude of phase volt and having angle of 30 degree thank you see you in next video